when you are deciding to pick up artists in general, um, especially underground bands that are definitely sending you emails, because I know you have to get a good amount every every uh, every so often. Um, how do you pick and choose which bands you kind of want to do if they're not already um, having that experience in the industry? Well, if a band is smaller, I, I listen to everything that comes in. Mm-hmm. Um, I give it a chance because I've obviously had smaller bands that ended up surprising me. But uh, it has a lot to do usually with the singer. Mm-hmm. If, okay. If the singer is great, but say the music isn't so great, I I am stoked to work on that because like you can pretty much fudge everything else, but a bad singer, like no amount of auto tune can make a bad singer sound like a great singer. Yeah, absolutely. No, you know yeah. it makes them sound like they're hitting the pitches, but it's like pronunciation will be weird. And I'm usually not on the same page with somebody who's not very talented. Mm-hmm. Like it's, it's a struggle. And uh, I just don't, I'm just not a fan of, of, of doing any of that anymore. Like, I just want to work with people who are, you know, who have talent. Mm-hmm. So, like, yeah, Misfortune, they came in, or whenever they approached me, I definitely, I'd heard of them already, mm-hmm. and I checked them out again, and I was like, you know, these guys are pretty cool. Um, and I was especially stoked when they showed me the songs, because uh, they were already sick. They actually hired me to do one, a mix of one song, hmm. and then, then I was like, I don't know. They asked my opinion about stuff, and I'm like, well, all right, if you want my real opinion, here it is. You need to change this and this and this. Mm-hmm. Anyway, the song ended up way different than what what I what they sent me to mix because I think they tracked it themselves or mm-hmm. or something like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's like scratch tracks and such. But he has a fantastic voice. I mean, it's one of a kind. Um, I don't know if he knows that. You know what I mean? He's pretty humble with it. So it's like, I'm sure that was an easy decision to make with that. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, I think that's that's the main thing. And and like, also, I think, I think that's a huge thing. But I do like bands who are trying to do something different, you know, just be a little bit unique. Mm-hmm. Um, I don't know. Uh, just, you know, not trying to sound exactly like every single other band that's out there. Mm-hmm. And that, that usually piques my interest. 